Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing The Sims 4. We're going to be playing as Turg and we're going to gather up everyone in the neighborhood and we're going to save them. We're going to lock them into one house because you cannot trust Sims. They're wandering everywhere. They don't understand social distancing. You could argue that it might be a bad idea to gather everyone in a small confined space, but um, actually no, you can't because I'm making the video. <laughs> You're not here right now, so that's fine. I was actually going to make Jim Pickens do this, you know, as more of an evil thing, like uh, trap everyone in. The, the bunker, but it seemed more like uh, a turg thing to do. And to be honest with you, Jim's family is kind of fecked right now. I'm going to give you a quick look. So yeah, there's Santa Claus. Jesus Christ, you don't want that coming down your chimney. <laughs> well, first of all, I don't think it would fit, so I think you're okay. Jim surprisingly is shy, but also one of the least affected. I thought he was actually normal, given these little previews, but uh, then I swapped him into one of his outfits. And no, he's he's not normal. I really don't think it's safe to be barbecuing when you clearly cannot see. <laughs> and then you got Big Head Shrek, and you got Cyclops over here, <laughs> which also do not look normal. But yeah, we're gonna go back to Turg and uh, play as him. I like how it's called the Chaffick House. <laughs> That's not Turg's name. They named the family after the feckin' dog. <laughs> Turg doesn't even get recognized in this. That's so sad. Hey, who locked the door? Let me in. Keep unwanted guests at bay by locking doors. No, I want them inside. <laughs> Look at how beautiful he is. He is gorgeous. If you don't know, by the way, Turg is my character on my uh, Switch and Wii, so that is the context. What's Turg smart. That? Turg good. Okay, I think the fastest way to start this off would be to throw a party. Okay, maybe a spontaneous 4 a.m. party on a Tuesday wouldn't work. Let's, uh, can, I, can I plan it for, like, in the future? Is that possible? Oh, I wanted to throw a wedding, but I can't because you, you need people to actually get married. I don't have anyone for that. Let's do a good old-fashioned weenie roast then. Jim's family is safe in the bunker, so we'll just invite everyone else, including all the women he's impregnated. Oh god, I'm surprised you could fit through the door, but I mean, welcome. Hold on, it's snowing. Where, where are you going? Oh, feck off. The possessed child is here. Oh, for feck's sake. Well, one of my guests is already dead. Guys, get back inside, and more importantly, Turk, get your clothes on. He just saw women, and he was ready. All he knows is... Oh, feck. I was gonna say all he knows is impregnated any people, but um, there goes another guest. I don't know if she's dying or not. She's pregnant with a baby turg. Don't let this happen. Wait, is she pregnant? Feck, she is. All right, bleed for her too. This is absolutely terrifying, to be honest, this whole situation. Wait, can I just reset her? Reset, does that... Okay, I hope that worked. I can still hear her scream. Okay, Turg is angry for the first time in his life. Wait, she's still there. Can I just bring her back to life? Age, adult, disabled. No, 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 she's dead. <laughs> They're very different things. All right, you know what? We can't just let Turg's partners die like this. Let's just load the game. That was all a weird fever dream. Sure felt like it. The sad part is... I think I invited him to the party. <laughs> that is the sad part. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Plan a social event. All right, let's just invite everyone else that isn't under Jim's protection. <laughs> it's like the mafia or something. You just can't interact with them. Welcome, everyone I've impregnated. How are you? Don't scream at my owner. <laughs> oh my God, he's filthy. <laughs> Don't blow kisses at them. Everyone else is going to get pissed off. Sorry about the smell. That could be the plates, the dog, or me. Okay, everyone has joined the family. And they're all women. They're all after this fine specimen. And he's just happy to be here. All right, we're going to have to build some sort of decontamination zone up at the top where we can lock this interior door and leave the open one and then, you know, swap them around, basically. It, it's a good idea. I just, I'm not good at talking despite doing it for a living. I always get these houses and I just single-handedly immediately ruin them <laughs> like every time they're always nice little quaint houses but I just have none of it this creepy music really <laughs> sets the mood for what I'm doing like this is a good thing okay stop judging me you know I always thought I was bad at building in the sims but I think I'm actually starting to get pretty good at this specific kind of building in the sims which is a little bit worrying you see what I mean we've got like the little entrance here now with the, the little fancy sciency door we've got some science Sciency windows looking in. We've got some sciency vents venting the air out. We've got some sciency showers to decontaminate them, and then they can come through to the main house. It's the perfect plan. Although I didn't do it to the first people, so that might be an issue. <coughs> oh Jesus! I didn't do it to myself either. Lock door for everyone but Tur. He's doing this out of the goodness of his heart. People very different motivations when Jim locks people in his house and when Tur locks people in his house. They're all happy. They're like, "Aren't you delighted to be impregnated by Tur? Isn't it great?" Wait, you're not impregnated by Tur. Come with me. Oh God! Oh, who's coming in? Oh, it's just the dog. Okay, you can watch. That's fine. Just. 
Please don't shit on the rug. <laughs> I know it looks like shit already, but just please don't. Okay, great job. Oh my god, he looks terrifying with his eyes closed. That's someone who has a, another baby. Wait, were you already pregnant? Because if so, this isn't gonna work. Oh wait, no, they're, they're pregnant with Turgis' baby. Okay, great. Oof. We almost got caught. This is gonna become like a civil war. Oh, for feck's sake, what are you doing? No, no, don't hit me, don't hit me. You'll damage the merchandise, not the face, not the face. That's the money maker. We're gonna have to change outfits because every time he goes outside in the snow, he swaps to his underwear. There we go, that'll do. All right, Turg, let's go find some more people to save. Oh, wait, yeah, then my party's still active. Uh, party's over, folks. Uh, by the way, you can't leave. It's for your own good. They're all mingling there. It's only a matter of time before they realize they're all impregnated by the same person. All right, let's go to the lounge. No, you- actually, my dog can come. I was gonna say no one else can come, but my dog is fine. Honestly, I think he's my chaperone at this point anyway. Why is the bar outside? <laughs> it's winter. I can see your breath, bartender. It's worse than I thought. They all need my protection. Not just against the quarantine, but against themselves. Come back, come back. I need to make you my friend too. Oh my god, she wants to go on a date. No, 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 we're not allowed to leave the house. We'll all have a group date later, trust me. Feck, she disappeared. Feck. What's wrong with you? Honestly, why are you getting angry? Oh no, he loves me. See, I knew it. <laughs> He's confident because he hosted a great weenie roast, did he? <laughs> they came, they ate, they roasted marshmallows? I think only one of those things are true. Okay, buddy, I don't know what's wrong with you, but you are not coming into my house. <clears throat> okay, no, you're out. <laughs> no, this is not happening. I'm leaving. No decontamination can save this. Honestly, I think someone just drew on him when he was asleep, but still. All right, a new plan. Since everyone he knows so far is women, he'll just bring those into the house and re- Populate the earth. Oh, he likes that. <laughs> okay, go home, Turg. We're gonna invite them all over and we're gonna make them join the family. Get them into the decontamination zone. Oh, it's death day. <laughs> well, that's kind of ironic. <laughs> Try to save people. Oh, God. Well, it's an excuse for a party anyway, I suppose. A good old-fashioned weenie roast, I think, since he's so famous for them at this stage. Can't even remember which are already in the house. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Wait, I can invite them all, can I? Okay, I can. Even though they're already here. She just arrived and I'm already saying, can we have a baby in the shower? Why are you crying? You'll get your chance next. Okay, they're trying to do it in the shower inside. That's not gonna work. Okay, everyone in. Come on. This isn't hard to understand. You're being locked inside my house. Get in the decontamination zone. Okay, that's everyone in in fantastic now lock the door oh they're all crying because he's gonna impregnate her first oh my god they're all very upset i think it's not big enough to woohoo in we might have to expand this one okay let's try that again even though it's gonna piss them all off immediately Oh. Look at them, they're all giving out. Like, no, me next, me. There's not even a wall between them. <laughs> okay, you're clean. You can go in. You can join the family. Lock door for everyone but Shannon, and you get inside. And now, lock door for everyone but Turg. Turg, you continue your mission. Oh, Christ. Oh, Jesus. They're not happy. They're all crying. It's like, why can't I have an amazing man for myself? Okay, you're all pregnant and varied levels of pissed off at me. You're allowed to come in now. Unlock the door. <laughs> Don't do beckon sit-ups. Come on. Come in. Who are you? You want to join the family? Are you an elder? You can't be impregnated. You're not welcome in here. Go away. <laughs> She's like, please. It's cold and I'm scared. Oh, her back is going out. All right, you know what? Turg would allow it. She's like, what the hell is this? <laughs> Lock the door, Turg. Once you're in, you're in. You cannot leave. Except for the dog. They're, they're allowed to leave. <laughs> Apparently, even though that's locked. Oh my god, what the hell is that? What is wrong with her head? There is no Julia Wright in my family. I've gone through them all. Who the hell is Julia Wright? Do you reckon that's the, the pregnant lady's baby? What the hell? Who is that monster? I can actually cheat to hurry up their pregnancies, which is what I'm gonna do. We're gonna start in the kitchen and work our way back. <laughs> okay, I'm forcing them all into labor. I was gonna put them into their last trimester, but no, I'm just forcing them into labor now. They're all grasping their stomach all of a sudden. Why is he freaking out? <laughs> a pre-parental panic, a lot of it. <laughs> okay, she's very angry from being woken up. Well, you know what? You're going straight into labor then. It's freaking out. He's like, what do you mean you're all going into labor at the same time? We can't go to the hospital. We gotta stay here. This is like a reboot of Cheaper by the Dozen for feck's sake. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, it's going nuts, it's going nuts! Oh Jesus Christ, I'm gonna have to name them all. I'm gonna have to just name them all numbers. One Turg, two Turg, three Turg, four. <laughs> At least it will be clear on how many we have. 
Oh my god. Oh, we're gonna go berserk, aren't we? There's more. What was I up to? Was it seven or eight? I'll chance seven. <laughs> there might be two sevens here. And that day was awful. <laughs> yeah, I can kind of see that. Oh my god, there's still more coming. Jesus Christ. All this crying. <laughs> God, okay, that's 10. <laughs> okay, I think we're done. Have a sim give birth to triplets, oh my god. All right, let's see here. Uh, hire live-in nanny. Yes, I think that's a good idea. I hope we're paying her a very fair wage. Oh my god, there's more? Jesus Christ, when are you gonna stop? I'm afraid some of them are gonna get taken away too quick. Okay, I think we're done. I can finally go into the build menu. All right, this is no longer the living room. This is the baby room. This is where we store the babies. Right, there is a definite shortage of chairs in this house. <laughs> oh, one's in the bathroom, okay. Okay, I'm playing find the babies right now. Oh, there's plenty more in here. <laughs> I was wondering, I was like, I feel like I'm getting too many alerts for how many babies there are in the lot, but they're hidden everywhere. Good, is there any outside? No, there shouldn't be anyway. And upstairs is clear too, perfect. <laughs> Okay, they're gonna have their hands full. Where is the nanny? <laughs> we desperately need that nanny. Eleven is very hungry. Which is eleven? <laughs> Ten. Four. Oh god, I wish we put these in the right order. Uh, eleven. Someone feed eleven, please. Not gonna lie to you. Not all of you are going to make it. In fact, very few of you are going to make it, but we'll try to keep you all alive. Hire second live-in nanny. I think that's a good call. Oh my god, they shut off her power. Dude, I have 11 kids. <laughs> How am I supposed to support them if you shut off my power? Really? <laughs> this seems cruel. Uh, for $18. That's why they shut off the power on a family of like 25. <laughs> for $18. All right, you know, I'll pay your feckin' $18. There you go. Will you turn back on the power? Thank you. I don't think the nannies are coming to live with us because our family is already too big. <laughs> can I just hire a nanny that doesn't live here? A nanny. Okay, yes. You can come in. I don't know how long they'll stay for, but please. <laughs> okay, I think with this beautiful sound, it might be a good time to um, end the episode. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what have I done? Yeah, we're gonna end it there. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you're staying safe, folks. It is weird times to be living in, and not just in The Sims, I mean in general. But, uh, wow, this has been a strange episode, but they all kind of are, I guess. <laughs> so no surprise there. I hope you enjoyed. I appreciate you watching, as always. And I do hope to see you next time. <laughs> Bye for now. I'm sorry.